AI versus Gen AI versus Agentic AI. So now AI is the major house and within that we have branches like Generative AI and Agentic AI. So what exactly Generative AI is going to do is, if you are able to give one part of the data, it can start generating another part of the data. You are giving a text, it can generate an image. Or you are giving an image, it can generate an image as well. So if you are giving a text, it can generate a code. You are giving a text, it is able to generate a video. So if you give one part of the data, it can start generating another part of the data in that you have types you can give either a text you can give an audio you can give a video you can give a gesture so we are able to call it as multi-model AI and where exactly agentic AI is so generative AI is if you give one part of the data it is able to provide us with another part of it that's what chat GPT is doing now agentic AI is if you are able to give if you are able to ask a question it is able to complete a particular task so by using generative AI agentic AI is able to complete a task for example I uploaded a file I said please analyze it and give me an image download so what this agentic AI going to do this particular question which you asked it we call it as prompt it going to be fed into your chat GPT or generative AI it going to get a code it going to to keep on running it until what you asked for it. So now agentic AI going to do a task for you, whereas generative AI going to give you a text or a video or an audio that going to be your generative way. That is a simple difference. If you want to know more about it and if you're interested to pursue careers into this, you can just reach out to me.